to watch the Dolly Rosal. And before we start, I would like to all you to your eye and pray to God together. Not for your eye, thank you God for bread today that we have been need to study with each other, but the good news from you was a lot. We hope that you always fulfill our spirit and our blessing your soul. Think for our your your glory to our heart. can uh, have a great day, great living stand up as well. Lord, we pray, we sing to you in Jesus' name, Lord. Amen. Now we're talking about the grace of God, and as we remember, we want to talk to you about David. I know that some of some of you know about the stories, some but some of you uh, don't know about the story at all. You know, David is just a small boy. He's talking about skinny boy, and he is a shepherd. But when he uh, He got the sheep. He always used slim to protect the enemy that uh, want to steal some sheep or kill the sheep that he uh, cover it. And one time he take some food for his brother and for his brother and other army, his army to feed them. And he bring it to uh, his his brother, and at the time he saw all them fighting big Palestine, and he sees the big man from the Palestine uh, soldier. He is a big body and have a lot of armor with with his uh, body, over with his body like a javelin. And uh, with the with the sun equipped, and the big sea like this don't have a uh, at this time don't have any uh, his eye, so yeah, they have to fight him. But at this time he insult uh, like any insult them with the many word. He said that. If have anyone fight with him or defeat him, he will take uh, his uh, soldier back to his uh, country. Now, uh, at the time, he will uh, ask so to be the soldier and to join with uh, his uh, soldier to uh, fight with uh, Palestine. That's led by a uh, lion, and it's only him want to fight with him. He use only one, one the small rock and one sling, and at this time he swing it and threw it to the midst of four head of lion, and at the time he can defeat of lion. And you see, that is a threat, threat. Because you know uh, the space that we can kill like enemies on the the uh, middle point of the uh, forehead, and others have a uh, mean that have armor to cover his body off. It is the threat of God. You know, only small small rock and only small boy can defeat the giant. It is the great thing. It is. The thing that God want to do, want to defeat uh, Palestine also. But David, he just bring the heart of God, the grace of God, the miracle, uh, the miracles of God to kill the lion. He do it with his faith. He do it with the grace of God also. And I also want all you be fed with God. Everything that you do, you need to pray to God. At the time, David also pray to God before he killed David. He also pray to God, and he supplied his life with God also. Everything God prepared for him to have a great life. Uh, I hope uh, for like that he. 
confusion caused the problem, the big problem. And he was just a small boy, but he holds the faith of God. The, he is just the believer of God, but he holds the big, big uh, supernatural power. Is God. Uh, for example, the people on us mean that especially Christian or other if our way miss the problem and how we can solve the problem as for the David his problem is like that the big problem and this is the problem of his eye so if no one can defeat like that his eye life will die or the problem will kill off so that David he use the faith, pray to God, ask God wisdom, strength, power to defeat the giant so that the peace of God can defeat the black end. So that if you can solve the problem, but all you do, you need to pray to God, use your faith, pray to God one more, ask for the uh, wisdom, strength, power to face with the problem or so. I hope that everything God can solve for you if you apply your faith with Him. Yeah, I hope that you uh, you will the lesson uh, is uh, good for you also to encourage your Christian life. And we will meet you next time. Bye bye. Thank you for your watching.